Welcome back to the channel friends. My name is Verona. I'm a meal planning coach and I help busy mums and women make meal planning so much easier. But today my friends, I finally caved and I got myself the Ninja Creamy. You can't even see, look at this, it's bigger than my head. And we are gonna unbox it. And I'm gonna make ice cream, Ninja ice cream with this thing. Now I'm somebody who likes gadgets. I never realized how much I like gadgets until I discovered Ninja. And this is not a sponsored post, by the way. It's just me who likes and appreciates the Ninja product. Funny story, when I got this Ninja Creamy, I was looking at this and I first saw it in Costco. And in Costco, it was 159.99 pounds. I was like, mm, ain't no way. I ain't no way I'm paying for that amount of money right now. Kept an eye on it. And then I saw this on Amazon. Where you get that? Amazon. Actually, no, I actually bought it from the Ninja website and it was on sale on the Ninja website. This is bigger than I thought. So how do you take this out now? Hmm. Hold on. <gasps> Not like that. I thought this was a five tub. <laughs> It said it came with five tubs. Let me double check. Can you see five? Can I count? One, two. I was gonna say a lid. Where are the other two? Oh, fix it, Jesus. Got him. Anyway, I saw this 159.99. And I said every time I went to Costco, and I went to Costco's about. Gosh, this is hard work, you know. I went to Costco's. Every time I went to Costco's, I double checked, and I was like, no, nope, 159 pounds, absolutely not. Ooh, girl, it's big, you know. This ain't no small thing. I don't have I don't have counter space as it is. In the box, what the offer that I got because I know they change. I have the four tub. How can you give me a tub, two tubs, and an extra lid? That don't make no sense. Huh? Who does that? No. Where's the extra tub unless it's on here? So I've got four tubs and a lid. Ninja, tell me, what am I supposed to do with this? Oh, the tub is in there. Oops. <laughs> but you get two tubs in a box and then one comes with the machine. Okay, smart, isn't it? Now I've got loads of mess on the floor, but it looks like a beauty. Hold on, hold on. Yes. Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? So I got the five tub model and I went on to Ninja and I thought, oh, let me get it from them directly. So I went on to their website and I was like, oh girl, we gonna, we gonna get it, we gonna get it. And put in my 10% discount. And then I happened to go back to Costco and it was 129 pounds, 99 pence. I said, what is that now? And I was so upset because I had ordered it. The day that I went to Costco and saw that it was on a discount, I had actually ordered it and I contemplated, huh, should I cancel the order? And I, but that was too long. I had the money, but I was like, oh, oh, don't mind this. I had a blood test this morning. But I was like, oh man. Anyway, I will say to you to check Costco to see if it's on order before you order and buy anywhere else. Double check. You may not be able to check online to see the orders that Costco has or the offers that Costco has. So you might need to just go there. Now in this part of the video, I'm going through the different quality and the different options that you have on this machine. Now I've got the Ninja Creamy 7 preset program option. Ice cream, gelato, sorbet, smoothie bowls, light ice cream, ice cream, Cream, milkshake and mix-ins if you want to add in some sweets and some sweet treats etc to your ice cream now I love the quality of Ninja remember this video isn't sponsored but I love the quality and this is what I'm talking about here at this part of the video and how you just line up everything and it clicks into place and all you need to do is put it into the machine and then you can begin freezing your ice cream which we'll see later on in the video I need to talk to the camera for this one but when it comes to, oh, we've got some good lighting over here. So when it comes to Ninja Creamy, yes, I'm all for protein ice cream. So I'm going to try protein ice cream. For me, ice cream growing up was dairy. It wasn't protein shake. It wasn't protein powder. And I'm a person who, you know what? We don't need to make things harder than they is. We don't. Yes, you might want to get in more protein, but do we really need to do protein? And are the people who are doing all of those protein things, this is amazing. This is delicious. Is it? Does it still taste like frozen, dusty protein powder? I'm gonna let you know whether this Ninja Creamy is living up to the hype. I'm also excited to make some real ice cream. I have cream, because I don't like it. So I'm gonna use full fat milk. I may put some vanilla protein, because we ain't got no space, baby. I would love to make all five, but if you look at the space, yeah, <laughs> there's no space to put them little tubs and you see how big those tubs are. We need to tidy up my space, but I'm excited now. I'm gonna wash one of the, two of these containers and I'm gonna make the protein, the viral protein ice cream and see what that's saying. All I'm doing is vanilla essence, milk and some sugar 
and that's it. Oh, I'm gonna make a vanilla flake. Don't have the strawberry sauce, but by the time I come back tomorrow, God willing, I might have the strawberry sauce and put a flake in it. So we gonna do it, girl. Let me pause for a second. Let me wash these two out, and then I'll show you what we're gonna do, and then we're gonna put them in the freezer. <laughs> okay, so I've washed the two containers that I'm gonna be using. The others I put aside. What I would recommend, though, is the lid is a little bit oily, so I'd recommend that you put them to soak for a while. So I gave those a good wash, but we're gonna make this. This is Premier Protein for the protein, viral protein shake. Got some vanilla essence, some vanilla extract, some whole milk for the vanilla ice cream and my sugar. You can use any ingredient you like. It also comes with a little manual, so it teaches you, like, I mean, like this milkshake, it tells you so many different things, like peppermint mocha. beauty about things like this. I love the fact that they give you a guide on what to make and how to make it. But the idea is that you get creative to make your own dime. One of these things I recommend if you've got nieces, nephews, cousins, families, borrow your friends, nieces and nephews, younger brothers and sisters, or your own children, and they tell you exactly what they feel, especially about this viral protein milkshake concoction. Protein sometimes can just be a glass of milk. You're meeting your protein needs with some chicken breast, some egg, and some salad. That's all that protein often needs to be. It's great if you're trying to lose weight and you want to find healthier alternatives. By all means, try these alternatives. Sometimes though, the healthy one is more work than the original. Sometimes you want the real thing and that's okay. I'm gonna let that freeze for 24 hours. And the beauty about this is you're not gonna get it right the first time. It might come out really icy and frosty and that might be a waste of 24 hours. And you see how much sugar I put in there. If we're realistic, I've seen some recipes use half a tin of condensed milk. Now that thing gonna send your sugars and your blood sugars through the roof just with one teaspoon. So don't have a panic attack for the amount of sugar that I put in. You can put in as much or as little or no sugar as you choose, it's your recipe. That's the thing about nutrition, you make it what you need to, however, there is still a base of health when it comes to it. That is why people do decide and try to make things healthy so that you can enjoy your favorite foods and still lose weight, which I get and I totally understand. But not everything needs to be protein. If you've ever tasted protein, premier protein before, this doesn't even actually have sugar. I intentionally just left it as it is. We'll actually see what this is like. And there are some protein powders don't have the casein, the casein, however you say it, in the milk protein do have that full fat milk effect. That is all we're gonna talk about today. I cannot wait to see the after effect of this. And I bought some flake. I'm sure I bought Smarties. Use this for the vanilla one. I don't know. I'm gonna see how this comes out first and maybe next time I might get the condensed, I don't really want the condensed milk. I'm not somebody who can eat dairy, but actually I don't want to speak that over my life. I can't eat this, I can't eat that. Actually, let's focus on our gut health first and then have these alternatives. Anyway, over and out because we are talking way too much. I'm gonna clean that mess right behind me. Oh, I bought a new bin. That bin cost me 95 pounds, but the best bin ever because the bin that came with the apartment, ooh, nasty. That bin, beautiful. I'll do a video on that one day. But that's all we got time for today, my friends. Can't wait to see you for the next part of this Ninja Creamy where we're gonna be making it all things creamy. See you tomorrow. We're back 24 hours later. We are about to try the Ninja Creamy results. This is not the traditional method to make ice cream. So I've just done my quick thing based on the ingredients that I had. And girl, we're gonna get it. But I'm gonna get it out of the freezer. Remember, I don't have high hopes for this. I have more high hopes for the vanilla than I do for the chocolate, but let's see. So I'm just showing you a close up of the vanilla ice cream compared to the protein ice cream. And what we do beforehand is just run it under some warm water because obviously it's been frozen for 24 hours. You don't want it to be too hot. And then this is the consistency. I want to make the protein, protein ice cream again because. Oh my goodness. What is that? Why did I allow myself to be easily influenced? 
take the lid off. And there's little grooves at the bottom of the cup that fit into the bottom of this. So just make sure that they are all aligned. Everything literally clicks into place. This one looks a lot better than that. This For me, this looks like ice cream. I don't know if it tastes like it, but <laughs> it looks like it. I am screwed. No, that's not aligned properly. There we are. I'm screwed. Oh, I'm screwed. Five minutes later. Oh my gosh, it's done. That was so quick. I don't even nick all the way. Ah, you can't even see it. But that is the first time I can't. You can't even see. Girl, I'm not gonna finish this whole tub of ice cream. That's greedy for me. It's so soft. I am tempted to taste this. It is a little bit crumbly on top. But what what I'm gonna do? Oops. It's like um, what do they call it? Ice shavings. Ah, this looks so good. I'm so tempted to taste it right now. In fact, I am. <laughs> that vanilla essence. It hasn't got too much sugar in it. It's cold, isn't it? It hasn't got too much sugar in it, but that's the consistent... Girl, you can't see that. You need more sugar in this, but... <laughs> it's definitely got that ice cream flavour and consistency. I can taste the hint of vanilla, but you definitely need more sugar. Ice cream is sweet, isn't it? So if you're somebody who doesn't... If you're somebody who does not like sweet... Oh, sorry. By the way, I'm crumbling in some flake. I'm going to remix this. Remix! <laughs> Make sure it is aligned at lip smacking. And then it's anti clockwise because it turns it around the other way to release the bowl. Take that out. It's easy. So easy. Take this out. Oh, it's stuck on the um. Not as easy, is it? <laughs> oh my goodness! This has made it. This mixing has made it soft now. Is the ninja creamy worth the hype? You bet your bottom dollar, girl. I could eat this. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh gosh, we're going to see this one. So just make sure that it's lined up with the bottom and then align it here. Make sure it clicks on. It looked nice. It's still crumbly as anything though. Oh wait, let, let me show you. It should have thawed a little bit more. So this looks good. Not bad. A horrible aftertaste afterwards. E. First, I mean, it's a no from me. No, absolutely not. I lied. Nope. Will I make protein ice cream again? Or am I going to stick to original ice cream? Girl, we got a winner. Ain't no way. You can freeze this and reuse it, but I would, re I would freeze it in a container as opposed to freezing it in this. Got myself a container. And all of the ice cream's gonna fit in there, but got myself a container that's going to get this ice cream. But, my friends. And before I eat the entire tub of this ice cream, I'm gonna end the video there. I'm gonna make a couple more recipes, not today. I wanna perfect the mint choc chip, which is my favorite ice cream ever, but we've got to go all out for that one. We are not having anything related to protein at all. But do I think the Ninja Creamy is worth it? Absolutely. If you're somebody who wants to make ice cream, you don't have six thousand dollars to pay, then I highly recommend you get yourself an Ninja Creamy and explore. If you do want to make protein recipes, you might want to try to see how you could perfect it. Literally got brown coloured water with no sugar. Anyway, we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and also send this to a friend contemplating about making protein ice cream versus regular ice cream in the Ninja Creamy. Mm -hmm.